caring, adventurous, brave. I was trying to find the perfect way to describe the type of person she was. And Tammy was a caring, adventurous, brave individual. I was actually lucky enough to meet who Tammy was. I personally met her through being a part of Rabbit Club in the 4-H Fair. Yep, <laughs> I know a thing or two about rabbits. But aside from that, uh, Tammy and her husband, Angelo, were one of those couples that always helped out with being leaders for the club. Teaching the younger kids, helping set up, and generally caring about others that were involved. And of course, my family was very involved, and so we got to know them pretty well. I remember when I was younger, and I was so shy as a kid growing up, but whenever I went to meetings, I remember Tammy always being very caring when trying to talk to me. Fast forward to now, 10 years to now, when Angelo reached out to me about this project, I was so honored and excited to have the opportunity to truly create um, a painting with so many meaningful memories behind it. Uh, he told me his initial thoughts and I immediately knew for something this special, I needed to hear her story. The two of them, Angelo and Tammy, met one another through their job actually, located in Elkhart. Uh, they started dating and ended up getting married on October 25th of 1986. During our conversation, I asked Angelo what he and Tammy liked to do together. He shared that they both loved going on adventures to various state parks actually in the U.S. Some of their favorite locations being the Tennessee Smoky Mountains, Ohio, and Kentucky, to name a few. Angelo explained that they just really enjoyed spending their weekends exploring these new places that they would just pack up their tent, some supplies, and drive out to hike, enjoy nature, and most importantly, enjoy each other's company. As we continued to uh, talk with one another about the project going forward, I mentioned to him how my recent work, I have not been using paintbrushes at all. And so I asked if there was anything that Tammy really enjoyed doing in her spare time. And one thing that she was really great at was crocheting. He showed me actually some of the things she had made for her grandkids. And I thought that was something very heartfelt and special and asked if I could use any of them to paint this portrait of her. I was so surprised that he said yes because I feel like most individuals would not be so confident in making a painting with an object instead of a paintbrush. But I was so excited because of how much sentimental meaning is behind the, the hooks themselves, you know. It just makes the painting more special and unique to who Tammy was. Aside from camping trips that they took together, uh, the two of them grew a loving family with one another. Tammy enjoyed helping her son, Brett, with uh, different 4-H activities, of course one of those being Rabbit Club. And let's just say, if you have never been to a fair, you are missing out. The amazing foods, tractor pull, demolition derby and concerts, it was definitely one of her favorite times of the year. Eventually, as Brett got, you know, older, he wasn't a part of the 4-H activities because there's a certain age limit. 
and uh, time spent at the fairgrounds in the summer was with her grandchildren, riding the rides, looking through all the animal barns, and of course, grabbing some ice cream at the dairy barn. Tammy and Angelo were married for 36 years as of until last year in 2022. 36 years. Along her her journey, her story, her life. Tammy, unfortunately, uh, got cancer. She had it once, and she beat it. And then, come to find out, she got it back again, and it was, it was pretty bad. And this is why I chose bravery as the last word to describe Tammy, was because Having to physically and mentally go through having cancer, I couldn't even imagine what it was like for her. Obviously, it had um, a big toll not on just herself, but her family, and having to pass away from something so tragic. I, I just, I can't even imagine what it was like to be in her shoes. Because to be able to go through something like that, not even once, but a second time and it's even worse. It, you have to have a lot of guts to just go through something like that. And she definitely did. Which brings me to the, uh, the last p most important part about this painting was that Angela wanted me to paint with her ashes, which I was, I was very nervous about because I wanted, it made it just more, um, more special, more sentimental, and just, obviously it's Tammy, like, I did not want to mess up this painting, and I wanted it to be perfect. Although she had a really, a really tragic death, the happy part about this all is that 
We can all remember her different memories of how caring and kind she was towards others. And, you know, she made those, those different outfits for her grandkids and blankets, which I just think that is so, so unique and special. You know, different memories you can hold on throughout the years, as well as, you know, this painting coming into the picture for their family to come in the next years. They can hold on to her memories through this portrait, hopefully. To just close us out, to remember those three very special characteristics of who Tammy was. She was a very kind and caring mother, wife, an individual who looked out for anybody and everybody around her. She loved going on, you know, these adventurous uh, camping trips you know, to different state parks to be outdoors and, you know, spend some quality time with her family. And finally, she was just a, a brave individual to have to go through something that has such a toll on a person that I just couldn't even imagine. If you would like to make a donation in honor of Tammy or support the organization that assisted her and her family through her battle with cancer, you can visit Ribbon of Hope. The link to their website is provided in the description box below. Ribbon of Hope has not only helped Tammy, but they have also helped numerous individuals within the community who are undergoing similar struggles. By supporting this organization, you can help make a difference in the lives of those affected by cancer. Finally, I would just like to express my gratitude for taking the time to watch and listen to Tammy's story. This painting that I have created is by far the most sentimental piece of work I have ever made. It is my hope that it'll keep Tammy's memory alive and well for her family in the years to come.